Hey guys, so I'm at the Grand Avenue entrance of Cal Poly, which is how the Grand Avenue show got its name, for some of you who may not know that. And I'm about to show you how big the Cal Poly campus actually is. All right, so I'm standing in front of Dexter Lawn, which is kind of the core of the campus. It's near the library, near a lot of the classrooms, and you can find your friends, students, just laying out on the lawn during their passing period or even their breaks, studying, napping, hanging out with their friends, even playing volleyball like behind me, and just having a good time. So you could probably find yourself, if you choose to come to Cal Poly next year, laying on this lawn and just having a great time. So you're probably wondering where I'm at right now, and believe it or not, I'm still on Cal Poly campus. You've probably been on many tours, just showing you where the classroom's at and the buildings, but that's only 500 acres of the total 6,000 acres that Cal Poly uses. On my right, there's this huge cow on the hills. On my left, I hear a creek. It took us about 20 minutes on a golf cart to get to where we're at right now. And I've seen many hikers and bikers just utilizing the resources Cal Poly offers. We're so lucky to have all these things right here on our campus. Another location outside the scope of the classroom is the Arboretum. There's a lot of plants, flowers, and a lot of agriculture majors come out here to work on their projects. There's a mini forest on my right, a mini golf course, which is totally random, but super cool. And you can just come out here to enjoy the scenery. The residence halls are behind me. You can just see the scope of the campus when you're out here, and it's really beautiful.